Hey guys, in this video we will be talking about how undergrad students, especially Indian students, get accepted to MIT, Harvard, etc. And what they had in their 9th class to 12th class profile, whether extracurriculars, awards, achievements, everything, including their essays. So let's get started. So before starting with the video, I really want to share that this data, this entire data has been collected from the profiles of Indian students who got into MIT in the last five years. And it's not need to be scared of all this data. I mean, this is 75 percentile of data. I mean, if you have so many achievements, then chances will be higher. If you have less achievements, less scores, chances will be there. Yes, chances will be there, but might be less. So that's why I want to say once again that if you have to keep aim, then keep it big, 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 keep it big. So now starting with the scores. So so first most important thing is SAT or ACT score. But you have to choose one of these two. So take one of these. And if you are considering SAT, then aim for 1500 plus. And if you are taking ACT, aim for 33 plus. And both are equally difficult. You should give both of them mock tests depending on which you feel more comfortable in. Then take that test and especially take with writing so now next is going to be SAT subject test and SAT subject test they require two SAT subject tests number one is math number two is science but the math option have math one and math two and sciences may they have like tons of options three options physics chemistry and biology so I personally choose physics and chemistry because I am non-medical student but if you want to choose bio you can and the MIT profile is different from common app so common app is an application section मतलब एक website है commonapp.org जिसमें सारी universities की applications होती हैं and this this common app has applications for all the major universities like Georgia Tech, Carnegie Mellon University, University of Michigan but MIT has their own application on their own website so that's why you will have to go to their website and first fill fill the information like your date of birth your family relatives like simple questions like if you had a relative or your cousin studying at MIT like these questions might be there and after that you will have these things to fill and the number one is summer activities and in summer activities wo janna hai ki aapne summer waste nahi ki. they want to know that like in 9th to 12th standard what you did in your summer each summer matlab ye nahi hai ki matlab wo chahte hai ki aap productive rahe each summer mein matlab they also want to ask you like if you went on a vacation where did you go but i personally think if you are in 9th standard you should always go for educational trips for example like if you're going to science city that's in jalandhar matlab i'm just giving an example matlab kahin bhi jana hai matlab education trip you can go for fun but i'm just trying you trying to make you more innovative matlab kahin bhi jao but they will ask you you like even if you went on a vacation if you even if you didn't do anything in that summer let's say up 10th ki summer mein bhi nahi then also write that <laughs> so i will say like once again if you want to utilize your summer break in the best possible way then go there these are the three major locations i mean there might be more but the kafi school se was summer programs hote i'm just telling you the top three summer programs available for you and these are the easiest matlab baki jo achievements hoti hai na jaise olympiads awards ikatthe karna matlab these are very very difficult for example if you want to be a national basketball basketball player it will require tons i mean years of training years of experience also if you want to be a gold medalist for any olympiad that will also require years of experience but imagine you are in 11th mein ho ge, 11th you have a non-medical leli aap ke paas matlab options hi kam hi hoti hai matlab aap dar jaoge ki matlab main itna sara itni sari achievements kaise ikatthe karunga but so that's why i have brought to you the easiest things to achieve like these three achievements matlab these three summer programs are easier than the awards awards in that many uh, Olympiads, sports, these are a little bit difficult because these require years of training. So number one is Yale's Young Scholar program. So if you looked at Ashish's profile, Ashish Sharma's profile, it, it is linked here. So he also went to Yale for a summer program and that was one of the reasons he got an MIT because this was considered as national achievement. And number two I will recommend is Harvard Summer School. But if you are in 9th or 10th or 11th, it doesn't matter. You can still apply for any of these two and even the third one, research at IIT. And basically what you need is like is you should have like passion. If you want to do research in physics at IITs, you have to depict passion in physics. So try your best to apply to all three and I'm pretty sure you will get into any each 
एट लीस्ट वन ऑफ दीज थ्री मतलब क्योंकि दीज आर एट लीस्ट ईजियर दैन गेटिंग इन टू एम आई टी एंड इफ यू विल मैनेज टू गेट इन टू एनी वन ऑफ दीज प्रोग्राम दैन एम आई टी विल डेफिनेटली बिकम ईजियर सो नाउ द नेक्स्ट थिंग इज वर्क एक्सपीरियंसिस सो वर्क एक्सपीरियंस इज ऑल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिकॉज दे हैव अ सेक्शन सो जस्ट लाइक दे हैड अ सेक्शन फॉर समर एक्टिविटीज उनके पास वर्क एक्सपीरियंस का भी सेक्शन है फॉर दैट आई रिकमेंड दीज टू ऑप्शन बिकमिंग अ ट्यूटर और डूइंग इंटर्नशिप्स एंड आई स्टिल रिमेंबर इन माई सिटी अमृतसर वहाँ पर मतलब छोटे छोटे स्कूल्स थे एंड दे डेंट हैव प्रॉपर एजुकेशन एंड यू कैन गो देयर एंड टीच सिंपल कॉन्सेप्ट मतलब आपको कोई बहुत हाई लेवल फंडा समझाने की जरूरत नहीं है यू जस्ट नीड टू टीच लिटल बिट कॉन्सेप्ट मतलब अगर वो नर्सरी में है दैन टीच ए बी सी डी इफ दे आर एंड फर्स्ट सेकेंड थर्ड स्टैंडर्ड दैन टीच दम हाउ टू मल्टीप्लाई लाइक टू वन जो टू थ्री थ्री वन जो थ्री थ्री टू जो सिक्स लाइक सम समथिंग लाइक दैट सो इट्स इट्स नॉट दैट डिफिकल्ट इट्स अबाउट पुटिंग एफर्ट putting your passion and showing that in the MIT application so that's all it's about and other work experience could be let's say that you did some projects matlab agar aap high school se programming kar rahe ho if you're doing programming since your high school then you can make some android ios web ai tons of projects and try to get into internship with the help of referral matlab kahin na kahin to reach out karo reach out to some companies in delhi bangalore hyderabad etc and they will definitely give you an opportunity if you are passionate kyunki matlab agar aapki age if you are like 16 year old and if you apply to company company ka bhi fayda hota hai company can say i had the youngest working employee in my company and you don't have to say that i want to make money to go there you can work there for free you can ask them you can you can tell in the application and that will be a great great opportunity and also jab mit ki interview hoti hai they also ask you like these things if you are passionate about biology if you are passionate about physics what you did for your passion well that is also very important agar aap internship karoge it will like it will become like ek path sa ban jayega that you are very passionate about computer science physics biology etc to aap prove kar paoge yes it is actually my passion with the work experience and now let's move forward with awards so like as i already told awards are a little bit difficult and they have two sections for awards number one is scholastic number one is non scholastic simple word scholastic means मतलब आपकी पढ़ाई के रिलेटेड लाइक नॉन स्पोर्ट्स मतलब ओलंपियाड्स आपने ओलंपियाड दिया आपने स्कूल में ऑनर्स क्लासेस ली मतलब दैट्स इन अमेरिकन हाई स्कूल बट आई एम जस्ट गिविंग एन एग्जांपल मतलब आपने टन्स ऑफ ओलंपियाड ले लेट से यू वर गोल्ड मेडलिस्ट फॉर बायोलॉजी ओलंपियाड जस्ट लाइक सूती खंड वाला और यू वर और क्या होते हैं लेट से दैट आई आई रिमेंबर बैक इन माई हाई स्कूल आई वन प्रोग्रामिंग कॉम्पिटिशन फॉर वेब प्रोग्रामिंग आई आई वन दैट कॉम्पिटिशन सो दैट कुड गो इन टू स्कोलास्टिक बिकॉज दैट इज रिलेटेड टू स्टडीज एंड नॉन स्कोलास्टिक वुड बी नेशनल लेवल बास्केटबॉल प्लेयर नेशनल लेवल बैडमिंटन प्लेयर स्विमिंग जिमनास्टिक्स टन्स ऑफ स्पोर्ट्स अपॉर्चुनिटीज मतलब कुछ भी ऑल्सो सिंगिंग मतलब दैट विल ऑल्सो गो इन टू स्पोर्ट्स रिलेटेड मतलब वो भी एक्स्ट्रा करिकुल्स में आता है सो दैट कैन ऑल्सो भी इंक्लूडेड फॉर एग्जाम्पल स्तुति शी हैड डांस शी डेड टेन ईयर्स ऑफ प्रोफेशनल ट्रेनिंग सो दे हैव टू सेक्शन एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलर सेक्शन इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम अवार्ड्स सो एक्स्ट्रा करिकुल मतलब है आपने ये नहीं बताना कि मैंने कुछ एक्स्ट्रा करिकुल करके अवार्ड जीता यू हैव टू टेल दैट बाई डूइंग दीज एक्स्ट्रा करिकुल आई स्पेंड टाइम फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू स्पेंड टेन ईयर्स एज as a dancer like and also it could be like you spend years by teaching gymnastics wo ye nahi kare ki extra curricular sections should only include the things you got award for they are just asking where you spent your time matlab let's say that i used to play violin that will go into extra curricular even though i didn't win any award to award ka section alag hai extra curricular ka alag hai and i also remember back in my high school us zamane mein limit hoti thi like 3 years ago the limit used to be for 10 extra curriculars in each section now it's for 5 in each of these sections so uh, that also proves that you don't have to do a tons of things you have to do less but do the best so that like you are representing your country you are doing at the national level so that's very important so now moving on the next section is about community contribution so community contribution has been already covered maine baat ki thi ki aap high school mein ja sakte ho you can go to a high school and teach kids that also goes into community contribution and other example could be let's say that uh, narendra modi he started cleanliness campaign that is called swachh bharat abhiyan if you participate in that if you're trying something for the country something for the nation something for the universe to so, matlab usse pata chalta hai ki aap community mein involved ho so that will also make an impact in your mid profile and you can add it here and there could be other community contributions like donating blood if you're 18 plus donating something else or it could be helping others at uh 
होमलेस शेल्टर मतलब कहीं पे आपने होमलेस लोगों को खाना दिया देर आर टर्स ऑफ थिंग्स यू कैन डू फॉर कम्युनिटी इन्वॉल्वमेंट एंड यू कैन एड इट हियर एज वेल सो नाउ मूविंग ऑन विद द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट फैक्टर टू गेट इन टू एम आई टी दैट इज एस ए सो दे हैव फाइव क्वेश्चन टू शॉर्ट आंसर क्वेश्चन थ्री लॉन्ग आंसर क्वेश्चन एंड दे मेनली आस्क यू अबाउट वॉट्स योर पैशन वॉट यू डू फॉर फन मतलब आप मतलब मजे के लिए क्या करते हो दैट कुड भी लाइक प्लेइंग बास्केट बॉल प्लेइंग फुटबॉल प्रोग्रामिंग कुछ भी जो जिस पर वो भी करने में आपको मजा आता है सो यू शुड राइट दैट एंड कम्युनिटी इन्वॉल्वमेंट we already talked about that and what's the most challenging project most the most challenging task that you have accomplished so far or it could be like why you chose mit why you chose this major or also it could be like your journey matlab aapne bachpan mein kya sochte the that you wanted to do computer science biology physics etc matlab aapki journey how you became passionate about this subject matlab i know that they don't say that ki you have to choose computer science you have to choose your major right now but they still want to know your interest matlab kahan aap jana chahte ho you want to do in non stem stem bio etc so they want to know that and now talking about essay i have like covered everything i mean maine har ek essay ke bare mein baat ki hui hai but i still want to repeat that in essay you have to portray your passion matlab aap sab kuch mix kar sakte ho like your experience at the summer schools olympiads uh, tutor being being tutor work experience everything and i prove kar sakte ho that yes by doing all of these computer science physics chemistry whatever you choosing is actually my passion and aapko directly ye nahi kehna that i am all rounder you should be proving that i am all rounder for example matlab jitne bhi log jitne bhi students mit gaye na they said ki i got into mit because i think mit read from my profile that i am all rounder matlab wo kuch wo matlab padh ke pata kar paaye that he is actually all rounder not through like reading matlab us bachche ne khud nahi likha tha i am all rounder because of this this is he wrote that i am passionate and i did this this because of my passion and that's how i proved to be an all rounder not directly wo matlab directly nahi kehta i am all rounder so you should not be considered matlab aapko apni tareef khud nahi karni hai you should just talk about your passion and why you did these many things for your passion and unhe khud pata chal jayega that you are actually an all rounder so that should be the goal and now i also want to talk about ap exams because like ap exams hai na ek naya award ban jata hai i also took like four to five ap exams and if you get five out of 5 and 3 ap exams then add also becomes a great great award they give you distinction for that and that can also go into the award section or these are the list of ap exams matlab itne sare ap exams are like ap chemistry ap biology ap computer science ap world history ap us history matlab itne sare hai you can take in your 9th to 12th standard matlab ye jitni bhi maine cheeze ki baat ki hai na you can divide according to how much time you have matlab 9th to 12th standard matlab jitna aapke paas time hai us hisab se aap चीज़ें करते जाओ कि इफ़ यू आर इन टेंथ आपको डरने की जरूरत नहीं मैं लेट हो गया मैंने नाइन्थ से तैयारी करनी शुरू नहीं की थी यू डोंट हैव टू बी स्केड यू कैन मेक योर स्केड्यूल राइट नाउ एंड जस्ट प्लान आउट मतलब आप जो जो चीज़ें अभी कर सकते हो स्टार्ट डूइंग राइट नाउ एंड कीप प्लानिंग फॉर एम आई टी हार्वर्ड एक्सेट्रा एंड यू विल डेफिनेटली कैर इन सो दैट्स द कंक्लूजन एंड दिस अनदर वीडियो ऑन ए पी एग्जाम्स ऑलरेडी मेड सो यू कैन चेक द ए पी एग्जाम वीडियो लाइक इन वट टाइम वट टाइम ऑफ द यू कैन टेक इन बिकॉज लाइक ए पी एग्जाम्स आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट आप साल में एक ही बात ले सकते हो सो डू ऑल्सो चेक आउट हाउ टू प्रिपेयर फॉर ए पी एग्जाम्स इन this video so that's pretty much it for today thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one goodbye